Mr. Richards, sowohl die Assassins of Kings in den Händeregalen stehen, werden noch ein paar Monate vergehen. Wir treffen uns aber nun mit Marek Zimak, dem Level-Designer, und Konrad Thomas Kiewicz, dem Lead Implementation Designer von CD Projekt, die uns Rede und Antwort zu The Witcher zustehen werden. Das ist für mich, dass um, The Witcher 1 war, es gab viel Action, es gab eine tolle Story, es gab tolle Charaktere, aber in meiner Meinung war The Witcher 1 nur über Sex, you know? Wie viel Sex wird es in The Witcher 2 sein? Exactly. Sex is a part of the world, so you yeah. can have sex, you know, with a lady on the street. It's still probably not going to be a problem, but it's not like the core of the game, of course. It's just a part of it. Okay. Also, big thing in The Witcher was uh, the conflict between the races. Will there ever be peace between the races in The Witcher 2? Yes, of course. There will be. If you remember from VS, the show on the start of the year, there was elves, there was uh, yeah. There still is a conflict exactly in it. This conflict is like the essence of the world, so now we cannot, you know, like end this conflict because it would be a huge change in the in the world's reality. There are a lot of conflicts and there will be conflicts in the future. The controls in the Witcher was a bit tricky. In which way you improved the fighting controls for Witcher 2? Uh, for, first of all, we made it easier. We created uh, a combat system from scratch. It's a totally new one. So we wanted to make it as complex as the one in Witcher 1, but then again, easier to use and more dynamic, spectacular. It was hard to master, right? We have also the styles from Witcher 1, the strong style, the fast style. Uh, you by the click of the button, the left button is the fast side, the right button is the strong side. When you mix them, you can make some combos uh, which give you a good style. And also, uh, the main difference uh, between Witcher 1 and Witcher 2 is that in Witcher 1, the uh, combat system is based on the turn system. And in Witcher 2, it's uh, in real time. When you dodge, you dodge. You know. our, our enemies uh, have uh, their own AI. They have strong and fast enemies, they use shields for example, and when a guy has shields, you might grow the shield or do how to find him and kill him. It would be, I think, more interesting and more spectacular. The graphics in The Witcher were great, um, but the new engine seems to be way more realistic than the one in The Witcher 2. Can we expect improved effects and improved Sure, the visuals like changed totally. We believe we're the best looking RPG game of 2011 because, we, first of all, we got a great engine and great programmers for making it. Second of all, we really have good artists. Those are like the best guys out there. So they can really create detailed characters, beautiful locations. Yeah, it, it's it's all about people after all. You know, they're, they're really good at it. So that's why the game really looks so nice. And they love the world. Yeah. That's why yeah, that's, that's it. You wanna say something to your fans out there? Yeah, sure. Um, we love you all. Yeah, guys, we love you. Wait for our game and, you know, we deliver you the best game you play. Yeah, we love games, you love games. Yes. They love you too. Yeah. And we love you. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. It was great. Yeah, yeah thanks. Thanks, man.